Guys, this is an emergency video. And as you can see here on the RSI daily, we're currently showing like we're going to have a breakout. Obviously, this is a daily candle. So we need to wait until the day completes before uh, confirming that we are above this resistance, you know, represented by this yellow line, which is really bullish right but we need to wait until the end of the day if we close the day below this resistance right there at rsi 55 on the daily then the likelihood of my outcome which we've been talking from early january which is to go test the resistance there and then come back down to the bottom of the channel but since this has been kind of playing out so far but uh, it's been longer than expected, right? You, I was expecting to go there, get rejected, and immediately go down to 35. But since this has been taking longer, now we are at this level of 55, and the bottom of the channel is getting closer to 30. That level 30 on the RSI coincides in the price, if we focus on the RSI reverse engineer that gives us a 36.5 okay at that point if you focus on the price action here above we will have completed fully the development of the head and shoulders on the daily channel and that one will have a target below 30 or possibly very low 30s if it plays out of course we it's too early to say and currently we are all celebrating the the breakout we are above 44 but keep an eye on where we are where we close today are we closing above this 44 are we confirming on the other side daily to remain above this resistance and remember my thoughts about the golden entry on the other side I much more prefer a breakout from a level below 50. So I prefer that the whole range of the RSI has fully exhausted to the downside and then to see a breakout somewhere here or even lower to give me many tests of the resistance and to increase the likelihood that this is not a fake out. Currently, we are breaking out and we are already at 60 RSI. So, yes, this can be continuation. That's likely. It's pos that's possible. <laughs> that's what I mean. But it's not necessarily the most likely a scenario currently. So we need to be cautious uh, with this. And if I was to do a swing trade here on the daily, I will wait until the end of the day to confirm that. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this quick catch up. If you did, make sure you hit the like, subscribe, leave me a comment down below, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.